Hey everybody, it's Edie here, your video and YouTube strategist, and I wanted to come in to respond to a question that a viewer left by the name of Tom Thumb. Thank you so much for your question. And his question was in reference to how do you get the audio to work when you're doing a PowerPoint screen recording? And my apologies for not actually explaining this in my previous video. First and foremost, you need to have a USB microphone that's plugged into your computer. I'm using an Audio-Technica AT2020 microphone, but it could be a Snowball, it could be any of the myriad of other USB microphones that are out there. I think it's best to have a, a USB one as opposed to one that's plugged into your microphone jack only because the quality is so superior. Um, PowerPoint has a way of knowing exactly which mic to pull the audio from because obviously most of us have built-in microphones on our computers. I wouldn't recommend doing that just because I don't think the audio is going to be as clear. So if you have a USB microphone, I think that's going to be your best bet. So that's all you really need to do. If you cannot record your audio just based on what I just said. It's obviously because you either don't have a USB microphone or there's some sort of technical issue that you're running through and you may need to Google it to figure out what the problem could be. Um, but what you would do in order to get the audio to sync with your visuals is you would then need to open up your PowerPoint. What I have on, on screen right now is simply a template that I pulled from PowerPoint and then I added a blank page before it just so that you can see exactly what it is that I'm going to be doing um, and you'll figure this out in the end why I'm doing this is because this is where the recording is going to appear. So in order for us to get started we need to first um, go to insert and I wanted to talk to you before we click on the screen recording button. I wanted to also let you know, in addition to live recording your audio, you can pre-record it as well, either if you get it from um, a MP3 or a WAV file um, that you have on your computer, or if you want to record your audio on each individual slide, you can go ahead and do that. Um, if not, you can just come over here to screen recording and you see that it um, automatically uh, comes down with this little um, tab that shows you all of these different icons. So this one we're going to use just to record. When we're ready to stop it, we're going to hit this to stop. If we only wanted to select a specific portion of the screen, we can do that by clicking this. If we did not want to have any audio on here at all, we can mute our microphone. We're not in this instance. And then also if we did not or do want to capture the pointer, so if we want to, um, or if we don't want, if we want to make sure that the pointer is selected, we can do that. If we don't want it, we can then deselect it, I guess is the word. <laughs> so anyway, so when we're ready, we just hit record. It counts us down. It's on the screen that it's going to start on. So you just start talking at this point. You can say, welcome, everyone, here's my presentation. You then just click to go from one slide to the next and then you continue to speak on this slide and then you go on to the next and to the next and to the next until the next and to the next until you're finished so i think we're ending so now we are done and this indicates that we're done when you're finished you can then just hover back up here where it allows you to either pause your recording or you can stop and it tells you how long this recording was. So right now we're at 43 seconds. So we're just going to hit stop. And as soon as you're finished, it automatically embeds your recording onto the first page or first slide of your presentation. To test to make sure that this recorded, I'm going to stop speaking so that you can see that it actually recorded that it's going to start on so you just start talking at this point you can say welcome everyone here's my presentation if you now wish to save your video as a separate piece of media you just simply need to right click it and go to save media as and then you save it you title it and you save it wherever you need to on your computer so let's just 
So there, you can see that it actually recorded um, the audio. So I hope that that answers your questions. If you have any other questions in reference to this, feel free to drop me a comment below. I look forward to hearing from you and take care.